Matt, number two on Saturday is the always interesting turf sprint. This year at Del Mar, it's only five furlongs. Does that give the advantage to the three-year-old filly? Uh, well, we know that uh, we know that Lady Aurelia loves the five furlong distance. I have Lady Aurelia on top here, and I have the other European, Marsha, who beat Lady Aurelia in uh, in their last start in uh, uh, over in Europe, uh, um, and. So I've got two euros on top in the turf sprint, and I have Disco Partner in there. Although, and I, and I, I am usually not a guy that talks about post position much at all, but it certainly didn't help Disco Partner to draw the rail in there. Yeah, that, that's a concern for sure. And Matt, let's call Lady Aurelia an American, even though she's made more starts in Europe than she has America. Stone Street and, and, and all of her connections uh, want you to recognize her as an American filly. Lady Aurelia is the one to beat. I went back and forth uh, with her and Disco Partner. I think the post is not the most helpful in the world for Disco Partner, as well as the short shortening up to five furlongs. But I just have a feeling there's going to be some pressure. Lady Aurelia might get caught again like she did her last time in Europe. She's a deserving favorite. Uh, obviously, I could see her winning, and I could see her winning uh, impressively. But I just have a feeling Disco Partner's going to run his race, be close enough when they straighten out where he can run down the Philly late, probably the second choice. Marsha, you know, certainly uh, I have a lot of respect for what Marsha's done over her career in Europe. Uh, but uh, by far at Del Mar, I'm not sure she's quite as sharp as some of the others. So I'm going to go with Disco Partner, just a hair, just a slight upset over Lady Aurelia. Buchero, Buchero from the Tim Gleishaw barn. Uh, like I said last week, he's really gotten good of late sprinting, loves five furlongs, coming off a very nice win at Keeneland. So I'm going to throw him in as my third pick. So in the uh, turf sprint, I'm going to use Lady Aurelia, Marsha, and Disco Partner in the Philly and Mare Sprint, I'm going to use Sky Diamonds, Highway Star, and Unique Bella. I can't not use Unique Bella in there. Then we go to the Philly and Mare Turf Race, where, of course, I like Lady Eli, but I'm going to I'm going to throw in a few other horses just in case, looking for a price here. So I'm going to use Lady Eli, Rhododendron, Cambodia, and Queen's Trust, and then I'm going to single Mind Your Biscuits. 50 cent pick for not a big ticket at all, only $18. May not pay a lot, but we get some, uh, get a couple upsets in there, and Mind Your uh, Biscuits is going to be a good price. Um, those pick fours pay a lot in uh, the Breeders' Cup with the big fields. 